Hi, this is the Nuvem, Nuventer Multifunctional Makeup Pen. Uh, I saw this, I was just interested because the color looked so pretty. Now, it comes in this big, big tube, right? The product in here is 15 grams. 15 grams. 15 grams would probably fill up the tube to like here. Okay, so when you get this, you pull and then. Okay, I never get this. Well, I, it took a little learning curve to not. Get. so you have to hold it here and then turn it this way it's open now so you can put a little see ice this is so hard to get off your skin when you want it off so once again this is the color it does blend nicely on skin But for some reason, it disappears really quick during the day. I just put this on. I, this is my second take. I, I messed the first take up. So I'm already having this on. But what really bothers me about this is it's kind of messy because it, com it comes out over here too. So you gotta be careful. Then you turn it back closed open closed okay but now it says multi-functional right so this is one product here's the box i'm always interested in seeing what's in it and this is something i've never noticed chinese pro one product multi-functional on the back it tells you what's in it but it's kind of really weird because it says contour contour blush highlighter okay i don't know how you okay you can probably contour with this highlight i don't know uh the color payoff is okay but it doesn't stay on long unless you fix it like really well uh, i don't have any makeup on other than this this um blush just to show you it does have a color payoff this is how it looks on the hand. It doesn't have any kind of shimmer so that it could become like a dewy highlighter or anything. So back to this. If it's the same product, right? And it's used for each one um, for blush, highlighting and contour, shouldn't there just be one ingredient list? But for each one, there's a completely different ingredient list here. I don't, I don't understand it. It should be the same. Since this is the multifunctional pen, which you uh, can use as a blush, highlighter, and contour, why does it have different? I know you can't possibly read this. But I'm gonna to try to make a close-up as close as possible picture so you can see what I mean. I am not I would not suggest putting this on your lips ingested in any way. And even I now feel weary putting this on my cheeks or skin in general. Um, it's gonna take a long time to get this wash this off. I said this again, but on the cheeks, it disappears quite fast for some reason. I don't know why. Um, let me just, oh, I didn't show you the, did I show you yet? So this is the color. It's a really pretty color. And It does feel like velvety, a little or 
this out of my hand. <laughs> it feels, yeah, it feels velvety. But it also sets quick. This doesn't make, I know this doesn't make any sense. It's blendable, but you have to be quick with the blending. Otherwise, you can't blend it out really nicely because it sets into your skin. Uh, I don't know how to better explain it, but um, this point, I wouldn't get this again uh, simply because of this. Um, I don't trust the this many st different stuff in here, many ingredients, and really the this feels completely empty. Even if you'd like take it completely off and you push whoops see I got a little bit coming out but I had to push right up here this is where most of the product now is because I had see but there is nothing down here if I press down here nothing nothing and I only used it just now and about three takes to get this right I'm already over the time, so um, <clears throat> I would say give it a try if you trust this. Maybe you like it, but be careful, okay? If you have sensitive skin or allergies to something, just be careful.